With Global Forest Watch, you can create powerful and customizable data visualizations. To view global data, navigate to the GFW interactive map. As you'll notice, tree cover loss and gain data is displayed by default. Using the tabs across the top of the map, select the data layers you want to display. Turn the information icons in the drop-down menu on to learn more about each data layer. Use the legend on the left-hand side of the map to view data layers that you have turned on. For data layers restricted to a particular geographic region, you can turn on Geographic Coverage in the data legend to see the area that the data layer covers. For tree cover and tree cover loss data layers, you can adjust the tree canopy density of your data display and analysis by clicking on the highlighted percent canopy density within the legend. Most data layers under the Forest Change tab can be viewed as a time series. Press the play button on the timeline to view an animation of the entire time series, or drag the ends of the timeline to select a specific period of time. Other data layers allow you to click on individual data points and polygons, or shapes, to view additional information. This feature applies to NASA active fires within the Forest Change tab, and data within the forest use, conservation, people, and stories tabs. Click on the data point or polygon and an information window will appear. Access basic map functions on the bottom of the map. You can zoom in and out, share your map view, hide the windows, search the Google Map base, and refresh the page. Finally, change the base map to view data with a different map background here. You now know how to visualize global data on the GFW interactive map. To learn more about using GFW, click through the tabs of information below or watch another tutorial video.